What up everyone? FG back with you. Just walk in the uh, neighborhood, taking the dog for a walk. Today's video is actually gonna be right where I'm standing. Is uh, I'm gonna bring you all the footage I took from Hurricane Melton last, about a week ago now. Um, all the footage I took of driving around, walking around. Um, I have a couple of drone videos that I posted on my channel already. Just look under uh, Flagler States for those or drone under the uh, drone playlist. If you want to look at that, check them out. But anyway, this um, the road I'm walking on now was completely submerged. Um, that house did pretty good. The lot didn't really get that flooded, but um, this whole entire street was underwater. So they just uh, came and fixed it yesterday. It had some uh, pretty big, uh, not pot, long, long potholes. This is all sand. So when this gives out, it really gives out. Um, and that end of the road didn't do too bad. But you can see all the drainage ditches. <clears throat> this drainage ditch was full to the top. That one was full. And like I said, where I'm walking right now was probably at least a foot of water. And all this, uh, this road was uh, washed out. So, well, and then this whole entire area where I'm pointing the camera was underwater so like this whole section of this um, neighborhood all these little side streets were completely underwater from the uh, from the you know ditches right here not draining you can see the there's still water in this one it's pretty stagnant water but that's pretty much the uh, the water table right now here. And this ditch over here, this one's not draining that bad. But all the ditches on this end of the road drain towards that way. And the ditches on that end of this road drain towards that way. But like I said, right here with at least a foot of water, <coughs> And that house, which is for sale, I wouldn't be buying that house. But that driveway had at least a foot, foot and a half of water in it. And that house back there was pretty surrounded with water. <coughs> so, buyer beware. I hope everybody's uh, doing their research and looking at the flood maps. Um, you could go on realtor.com or Zillow and look at the uh, area where you're going to move to. It's pretty windy right now, so I don't know if it's blasting into the GoPro. But um, you can go to Zillow or realtor.com and um, open up the maps and click on uh, the layers. I think it's layers. And look at uh, flood. And that'll tell you if the uh, house is in a flood zone. So it's a good tool to uh, to use. Yeah, you can definitely look and see if you're uh, the perspective house you're going to buy is on a flood zone. You probably don't want to buy in a flood zone. So this ditch was draining into there, which drains into this big ditch over here. Man, it's really windy. The farm across the street. Anyway, this drainage ditch, which is almost completely empty now, was filled right to the top. It was almost overflowing that bank. And down there, farther down, um, I'll show you the side of the bank washed out. Um, but the problem is this farm right here and the other farm down at the end of the block filled up completely and it drained into this ditch so all this water all the water from there 
um, water really had nowhere to go. So this whole entire area got flooded. Um, so I'm gonna show you in a minute uh, the drainage ditch down there. I'm back. So getting back to the drainage ditch. You can see right here where the bank kind of washed away. Man, it's windy out today. Right here. And over here is even worse. Look at that one. That's pretty bad. So that's going to need to be fixed. But anyway, this farm right here is a sod farm, so you wonder why they planted. You wonder why they planted sod. Um, you know, probably because it floods every good hurricane. So the, this farm and the farm on the other side is also a sod farm. And that that farm flooded really bad. Um, oh, yeah, I'm failed to mention. I'm up development called Flagler Estates which is in Hastings Florida which is Central Florida so this ditch right here which is pretty empty normally um, was filled right to the top because this farm right here this little uh, the little bank down there gave way you can see it in my drone videos I posted and it was literally dumping into this ditch and this water had nowhere to go and all the side of this road was completely i mean and then farther down the streets was completely underwater this house over here was pretty inundated with water um, and then all the side streets these are all dead end side streets all these dead end side streets literally halfway down <coughs> the half that drains into this ditch were uh, completely flooded I feel bad. This guy's a pretty nice guy too. I feel bad for him. But anyway, so I'm gonna post all the uh, the footage I took from Hurricane Milton, which was last Wednesday night and Thursday morning. I think it was like October 15th and 16th. Um, so let me know. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, and how you like the video. All right, see you on the next one. All right, FG's back. Now for the dog walk. Post Hurricane Melton. Have to see how the neighborhood did. Overall, my house did too bad. Look, water came nowhere near the house. So obviously. Grading the outside of the house is 100% key to keeping your house from getting flooded. It looked like down here got flooded. It's still a little windy out. I was out at like 1 a.m. last night hooking up the generator and uh, at the height of the hurricane. And it was ripping. It's still pretty windy right now. This is my street. Nothing but me and the critters. Wow, it looks like down here is flooded pretty bad. Wow. I might not be able to get through here. Dallas is loving the wall. Are you going for a walk, Pop? Dallas is loving the walk. Wow, look at down there. I might get that one. Wow. <laughs> wow. I'm not going to go get through there. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. And I just, they just built this, uh, this uh, mobile home over here. And that lot didn't do too bad. I have no idea when I'm gonna get my power back on. 
up about in the middle of nowhere. Wow. <clears throat> Look at this ditch. That, that ditch right there drains down to the main ditch down there. Thank God mine drains to the ditch down that way. Otherwise, I probably would have been flooded. Look at that lot. Wow, look at this. I don't know, pup. We're not going to be able to keep going. My road is underwater. <laughs> wow, look at that ditch. That means the, uh, I got my, uh, I got my rain boots on. When you live out in the, the sticks, you gotta have these boots, they're great. You just throw them right on, go outside, they don't get muddy. Wow, look at this. I don't know, Pop, what do you think? St. John's County. Actually, I'm in a, a development called Flagler Estates, to be exact. St. John's County, Florida. Wow, look at this flooding. Crazy. I wonder if I could keep going. What do you think, Pop? You want to get your pores wet? Want to keep going? What do you think, Pop? Should we keep going? Wow, look at this flooding. And the, uh, the street that way got major, major flooding. We keep going? Wonder how deep it is. What do you think, Pop? Want to keep going? I don't know. It's getting pretty deep, Pop. I don't want you getting. Ah, come on. Let's go home. Come on. He wants to keep going. Look. Come on. This water isn't the uh, most sanitary, I don't think. Come on. Now oh, we gotta go back home. Look, he doesn't want to go. Yeah. Come on, we can't go exploring. I would keep going, but I don't want him. Uh, I don't want him getting sick. He already got sick a few weeks ago from, I don't know, drinking bad water with animal fecal in it somehow and. I don't want that happening again. So I'm gonna bring him home and then uh, venture out for a walk. I'm gonna bring the drone with me. Get some drone footage. But the wind is still ripping. See the wind? It's like uh, I don't know. It's like 7:30 in the morning now, Thursday, October 10th. My ammo home drained pretty good. So. What up everyone? Thursday morning, day after Hurricane Milton touched down. Actually, Hurricane Milton made landfall last night, but this is that the, uh, I'm, in, I'm in a place called Flagler Estates, St. John County. This is the end of my street. And thank God my, uh, the ditch in front of my house drains the other way because this ditch ain't draining nowhere. Look how deep the water is. And they got to buy a pair of these boots. What are they called? True, True Dave. The best rain boots you could buy. The rubber, neoprene, like I'm going scuba diving. So I was going to bring my 
drone and take some pictures but it's raining again so i'm gonna walk around for a little bit i tried to take the dog for a walk and uh that's uh, starting to rain again it's like uh 8 30 on thursday morning wow look at that that bitch did not drain well whatsoever wow thank god i didn't buy it at the end of the street well look at that a lot that lot's underwater i'm gonna venture out to the main road I think that all them lots, I live like halfway down the block. I think all them lots over there, look, there's nothing behind me. I'm like the only house on this entire side of this property. And it looks like I'm on the, the top of the crest, so to speak. Wow, the wind's still ripping. Well, maybe all the uh, the good thing, all the uh, the wind is probably pushing the water away from my house. Wow! Wow! Look at that flooding. We're on Melanie Street. One thing about living in Florida, no matter where you go, no matter who you run across, people wave to you. No idea who those two people were. Look at this. Wow, look at this. Wow. Look how full that is. This is usually, I don't know, I'll give you another picture, but wow, look at that. <laughs> So hopefully this is the last of it and we don't get any uh, flash flooding. I'm gonna take a walk. I'm gonna take a walk on this block over here. I'm gonna turn the camera off, but uh, save some power. I'll be back. Wow, look at this. This is the drainage ditch on Melanie Street. Flagler Estates. The day of uh, Hurricane Milton. Wow, look at that. Wow, look at this street. This is Carpenter Avenue. Holy cow. Thank God my house ain't in a flood zone. Look at this street. This is Carpenter Avenue, Flagler Estates. Wow, those people ain't getting out. Melanie Street and Carpenter Avenue. Hurricane Milton. Look at that flooding. So, anybody looking to buy a house in uh, Flagler Estates, hit me up and give me a call. I'll tell you where to buy and not buy. I pretty much know. Uh, I pretty much know where to not buy a house in this uh, development. Wow! Look at this.
getting deep. Nah, I'm not gonna keep walking down there. Hopefully it stops. I can get my it stops raining. I get my drone up in the air. Well, I'm dying to see what the uh, what the lot behind me looks like. It's like all the way down there on the right. But this is I live like over there. So there's literally no houses at all in this whole entire cluster right here behind me. Nothing. So my house is like dead that way. There's no houses at all. There's one house on this whole entire block right there. Otherwise, this whole uh, this whole block is empty. And uh, I would not be buying a house or a lot on this road. So I'm gonna turn the camera off and uh, get in my truck and do some exploring. But great boots. True Dave on Amazon. Great boots. All right. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know if you have any questions. But I'm gonna do some exploring. Right. FG out. See, and I got no power. I don't know if I mentioned that. I lost my power at like midnight. So I got the generator going. And uh, I have no idea how much of Florida is out of power, but I got a. Uh, I got a stockpile of like 40 gallons of gas. I don't know how long it's gonna last me, but I'll see. I'll have to venture out and get some more gas today. But that should get me a few, I don't know, my generator's a hog. So, all right, gotta turn the camera off, do some more exploring. Look at that, look at that view. How can you not love living down here? Look at this. And this is normally what it's like during the day. There's like zero traffic. Wow, look at this. That thing's flipping. And the St. John's River is like that way. The town of Palaka, like, uh, it's like 20 minutes from here, the St. John's River. So I live here in the St. John's River and like St. Augustine is dead that way, like 20 minutes. So I'm kind of like sandwiched in between those two rivers. And then there's a deep bend creek down that way that goes, I think it flows that way. Um, so supposedly that, if the St. John's River and the tidal surge gets backed up, this gets all backed up. So, Flag Bear State's Florida survived uh, another hurricane. All right, I'll be back. Look at these houses. Look at this street. is up on stilts.
Flagler Estates, St. John's County. Wow, look at that house. They got lucky. Flagler Estates, Florida. Hurricane Milton aftermath. Massive flooding. Look at this farm. Look at this house. Look at that irrigation machine. It's sinking into the ground. Look at that, wow, it's a lake. Look at that farm. It's a lake. That's crazy. Look at that. That irrigation machine. I don't think that field's going to need irrigation for a while. Flagler Estates, Florida. It's a mess of flooding. Look at this. Oh, this guy's making it. Yeah, I don't think I'm going that way. That's how you roll in Flagler States, St. John's County, Florida. Yeah, buddy. That's how you roll. Chevy power. Look at that house. Freaking lake. Nobody's buying that house. Looks like the roof got ripped off. Don't 
parar hain us Look at the ditch. completely up to the road. Look at that street.
a badass pickup truck. But that's why all them houses are flooded. Look at the ditch. completely up to the road. Look at that street. That's a badass pickup truck.
<laughs> That's why all them houses are flooded. It's worse now than it was the, uh, this morning. Wow! Look at that water. That ditch ain't going nowhere. Look at a ditch. It's full. Look at a street to the right underwater. Carpenter. Wow. Look at that street, completely underwater. Look at that house. I guess I know why that house is up on stilts. Wow. Flagler Estates, St. John's County. Well, look at that house. They got lucky. Look at a dike. Wow, look at that house. Holy cow.
Look at them houses. Look at us, it's almost up to the road. Look at that, the fucking lake. Wow. This farmland's underwater. Wow. Holy cow. The lake. farm equipment sitting out there underwater. is completely underwater. I think that got worse since this morning. 